In May of 2020, the PMP team determined that it would not be safe for us to meet in person on Shelter Island for our beloved chamber music workshop. So instead, with two weeks to go, we designed a three-week curriculum for our festival online. We held webinars with tech gurus who helped us understand how to best use video equipment and audio equipment to best represent ourselves online on our new stage, the internet. We also held faculty sessions where each artist faculty member led a discussion about different types of chamber music or styles of music, or even interpreting music, as well as some of their favorite recordings and performances. And we talked about what made them great. We even talked about some of the difficulties we were all going through and the hardships at the time. There certainly were many, and it really helped us come together in this very intimate format to discuss music and to discuss our lives. We felt very close and by the end of three weeks, we were definitely bonded. In addition to these activities, we opted to have one large collaborative project. We didn't make it required, but most of the young artists volunteered for it anyway, as well as some of the artists faculty, I might say. We had been planning on doing all Beethoven chamber music because of course, 2020 is the 250th anniversary of Beethoven's birth. So we chose an excerpt from a movement of one of the early quartets, Opus 18, number four. I had been very taken at the time by the videos put out by sports teams trying to represent the idea of kicking the soccer ball from screen to screen, or the basketball team passing the basketball virtually from screen to screen. So I wanted to see if we could create something that would be fun and buoyant with the same spirit of passing a melody from screen to screen. We front on this video of tossing a Frisbee. That is because Frisbee is very important at PMP. We also then had to meet to rehearse on Zoom to figure out how to choreograph who would do what when. And we also came up with a storyboard. Initially, I tried to hand draw out the ideas. I'm not a visual artist, so it was very rough. Kind of funny, actually. But both Emma Bashi and Anna Coplin understood what I wanted. And so Emma took it and ran. She used the PMP logo to develop a storyboard so everyone would know when they should do what. And the storyboard is brilliant. I love it. It's one of my favorite pieces of art. We met online, we figured out what to do. Everybody recorded their excerpts. Everybody did what they were supposed to. We put it all together. And I felt that it was a very fun, beautiful representation of teamwork. I hope that you've enjoyed it. And thank you so much for reviewing the video today.